welcome to my channel so this is going to be a reading for the sign of pisces pisces my readings are timeless so when you see them is when you meant to hear them please don't forget to like comment share subscribe also please don't forget to hit the post notification bell so you can get alerts when my videos are posted pisces if you're new to my platform welcome please hit that subscription button it would totally mean the world to me all right so pisces this is about to get weird and ridiculous okay and why <laughs> well why not okay so let's see what are the messages for pisces all right several different scenarios here one pertaining to your money a level up of your money a change in your money an addition to your money So, next scenario, we got maybe doing something for money that you just don't want to do. All right, you focus on making money one way. You're being offered something else by divine, and maybe you're not looking at it. You're focused on you want to do this. But they're saying it's another direction. Also, we have an ending Feeling stabbed in the back. So that's a betrayal, okay? So we got somebody doing the wrong thing. This could be you or them. And I'm only saying doing the wrong thing because stabbing somebody in the back, especially if it pertains to money, it's not really good. You reap what you sow. All right. Different scenario. Something out about more money, but a little bit of money. So you started off with big money. So somebody may be playing with big money. Somebody may be playing with just a little bit of money. Okay. But y'all see these cards. They starting off with pinnacles. Pinnacles mean money and foundation. So that could also be your foundation. Somebody's foundation is bigger than yours. Or you just leveling up because we could also move up that way. So you may not be where you want to be, but focus on your goals. Again, it keeps coming out betrayal because now we got three of swords. So third party interference. That could also be some type of cheating, some type of dilemma here. Um, it's also given like selfishness. So that could be somebody deciding to take a little because I don't want to deal with whatever else comes along with the something big. But when you got a little something, you also had a little betra betrayal. When you had a larger something, you the betrayal was larger, a larger amount or a larger setback. All right, so we have the Six of Cups here. So we keep doing the same exact thing. Ring around the rosies. No matter what level it's on, big or small. All right, so different scenario. Let's see what we got here. See if it starts off with the same thing, all right? The messages for Pisces, please. All right, okay, so this starts off with your purpose. So... I feel like Purpose of a Driven Life, if you haven't read that book or, you know, heard of it, you might need to look that up. Um, but I feel like focus. So now money's not the highest priority. It's about what do I want to do? Did my, my purpose, why am I here? What's my destiny? Okay, I like that. All right, let's see what else more purpose but this is now happiness so it's like taking a different direction but still gaining everything it's just taking a different approach all right so more wands all right so we got the two of wands four of wands five of wands and then the world 
So everything is different, whoever this person is, or maybe it's surrounding by everything, but hold on. And all I hear is hold on to your love. Ooh. All right, so hold on to your love. Who is that? In vogue. Don't waste your time. All right, so don't waste your time on whatever the hell this is because we got a six of cups here. Um, reaching reaching out to others with love and compassion. It is um, giving somebody their flowers now. So somebody speaking well of you or you speaking well of somebody. But I feel like maybe all this is tied together for one person or like I said, different scenarios, but it all pertains to we either trying to figure out how much coin we about to get, or can we secure the bag or what are we here for? Like contemplating life, what is life? What is this? What is this? Okay. All right, so let's see what we about to do. Things are way different than maybe before because with these betrayals or these deceptions um, or with these harsh truths and the reality of things, we now look at situations or circumstances, maybe even people, or your priority is different. And that's understandable after you have gone through so much stuff. But it's also given like be gentle with yourself. Appreciate how far you have come. Even if it's like one foot, one day at a time. So just, you know, appreciate yourself. Affirmations. Affirmations for positive change. Positive changes. Um, grounding and centering. So that's bringing forth balance. Joy and delight. Imagine and enthusiasm. All right. So something about bringing things into balance. A transformation. But like I'm trying to change. So again, it could be what's my purpose. And then you go after the coin because we can actually go up this way too. Like somebody may have gotten married. Somebody may have got or that, that could be in a relationship or some type of partnership. Could be in business as well because partnerships are, you know, partnerships. Either way, didn't end well because there could have been interference. Um, just basically no balance in the situation, but a need for growth. And it doesn't mean a failure just because that didn't work out. Every level or every step is a step in the right direction, okay? Because you can fail many times and then succeed. So it's just getting back up on the course, all right? So then we have a four of cups going up again. So still you keep looking in a direction and it's something else being offered, something else on the table. Don't focus on, focus on your focus, okay? And your focus should be, you know, your purpose, your life's purpose, because that's where it looks like it's going. Um, I feel like getting connected, plugged in to the universe, Mother Gaia, or, you know, maybe doing some chakra work or something, maybe helpful, but it's okay. So now we got cards falling off, but it's strength. Um, you don't know your own strength until it's tested. And right behind that was a King of Pentacles. So definitely um, a leveled up in your foundation and your money area. All right, what's happening? A little bit of confusion. So it may have been a slight bit of confusion happening. You can do this. You got this. Excuse me. So somebody cheering you on. You got this. We got commune with the dead. Okay, I said somebody cheering you on. So you got this. And this could be passed over loved ones or you just speaking out loud to, you know, spirit. All right. Uh, it says the blue moon. And I feel like every so often, rare. All right. All right. Let's see what else we got here. We got explore. And then we have a line. So it's like creating your own and it's like if y'all haven't seen the shorts look at the shorts because it pertains to i think it's like the orange one so that could be like um uh, your chakra color or just a color that you like but either way um the chakra color that you're dealing with but 
explore your own personal pathway. Like your spiritual journey is unique to you. And so it can't be like cookie cutter version because what works for somebody else might not work for you. And so you have to kind of craft your spiritual journey or your spiritual pathway the way your guides or the way you are, which makes, in the way that makes you feel good, okay? So in that direction, that's what I mean to say. All right, seven of wands. So, convic conviction, but I feel like conviction meaning like jail conviction. Conviction in a fool. So, jail could be like spiritual jail, conviction in a fool. So, somebody being convicted or conflicted is what that's also giving me too. But I feel like a warrior. We got two of cups, energy, a union, partnership, mutual respect, love, equality. So we got a fight happening over a love. I got a love Jones for your body and your skin tone. So somebody has the right. I got the right. Oh, I'm going to fight for my right to party. <laughs> that version. So somebody's fighting to be with somebody that. And then we got the fool here. New beginnings, innocence, a leap of faith. Why do you like this person? They y'all could come from two side, two separate sides of the track. Why do you like this person? That's what they want to know. They're questioning why you like somebody or why somebody likes you. All right, we got an inner peace incoming. So I'm gonna just hold this up here. Y'all screenshot it and do with that what you will. Cause I'm not reading that. Okay, so hopefully everybody got it. And I said I wasn't going to read it, but I lied. Inner peace incoming. You may have had a disagreement or maybe someone has upset or hurt you. If you want to make peace but don't want to speak to them, you can do it this way for guaranteed inner peace. Number one, sit in a quiet place and close your eyes. Picture somewhere in nature. This could be on a mountaintop, on a beach, in a forest, or wherever else you may choose. Two, once you have a clear picture in your head, visualize your higher self walking from one side and then the other person's higher self walking towards them. See your higher selves meeting in the middle and imagine them talking to each other. Have a full conversation covering all areas you want to resolve. Three, now open your eyes. You should now feel some inner peace about the situation that was troubling you. Okay, so the number is 377. So if that's significant or important to you, I did show you guys the you know, page. Um, and yeah, so there's that. All right, let's see what else we got here. Okay, so we have the angel of time working too hard. So you could potentially be working yourself too hard or this situation could be stressing you out, okay? We got trick or treat. We're out trick or treat and we are here, which I also said something about your spirits or your uh, spirit guides or your ancestors. So that could be also pertaining to that, which I feel like definitely because we have ghost people. So spirit realm, realm helping you. We have storm angel, a collision of beliefs styles attitudes and energies and then we have a clockwork pump again also so a wonderful idea aha moment coming out of nowhere definitely uh something about the time being significant or important and 
I said something about somebody fighting. So we got Storm Angel, Collision of Beliefs, Styles, Attitudes, and Energies. So whatever the clash is between you and whoever that is, it could be that y'all are disagreeing because of your upbringing. Um, you were brought up different from this person and they were brought up different from you. So, you know, uh, that could be an issue, especially if you're trying to date this person and y'all decide that y'all want to have children or it could just be in the family dynamic because if the person already has children and you're new coming into the relationship, you could raise your kids have differently than they raise theirs and that could create a problem. So... Now we end up talking about people, kids and stuff, and that ain't cool. So you don't want to interfere in the way people rear their kids. That could be a thing. We have mermaid and a koi pond. Rediscover your individuality. Become the dragon. So something about the relationship, you may be outgrowing it or you outgrowing the, you know, where you're from, what you're doing. Uh, and it's time to move on because I did say an ascension happening. So a little bit of this and now you're moving into a larger a larger arena so now it's time to think outside the box and it may be a little bit scary because you might not know what's over there but it's okay and then we have your imaginary friend childhood treasures resurface so that could be you creating a, another like your sasha ferris or something your alter ego in order to be able to accomplish the task the fairy bee my life is sweet so you growing or gaining, but that's also like luxury and, you know, abundance, fertilization, so growth. So again, it went from one little thing to a higher thing. Um, the level up must be about to be amazing because it's Orca Magic. The Akashic Record, the Akashic Libraries are open. Somebody offering you a complete commitment. And I hear, your love is my love. I don't even know that song. So, whatever that could potentially be. Well, I'm going to take these cards right here. Hold on. I haven't used these cards in a little bit. So, we're going to get some. Get some. Get some. Out here. All right. Let me check these first. Let's see what we got. so we have the cross a conviction suffering and burden so somebody trying to hold you to something all right uh, uh, uh. oh somebody trying to make you feel bad okay um, research truth education somebody trying the book we got the cross of the book a 10 year difference between you and something or a four year age difference between you and something okay we got, so that could also be 14 years. The night here, energy, arrival, and action. So something pushing forward. And then we have the club here. I don't know why they gave me 50 cent. Um, conflict, opposition, and drama. Uh-oh, I did say a fight. So we still keep having a fight. Um, somebody trying to hold you to something. They trying to get you to turn around. They want you to make sure you keep your word. And there's a reading here that said, keep your word, Pisces. So maybe it pertains to that reading. Um, if you scroll down probably about a week or two, you might be able to find it. But they want you to hold your word to what you said. All right, accept love. Okay, so uh, accept love. Okay, so hold your word to whatever this love thing was or something or whatever. Uh, I don't know. Just keep your word. You might have told somebody something. And they say, <clears throat> well, you said this. Well, that was 9 million years ago. Beat it. Scram. Um, a few days ago. Okay, it might have been a few days ago you just told them that. Okay, so hold. keep your word, all right? So if it was a few days ago, keep your word. If it was 9 million, trillion, billion years ago, well, tell them shit happens and people grow up, okay? Um, you have the right to change your mind. You have free will, and that's what that means. So release me, all right? A contract to meet in this lifetime. See what I'm saying? 
It only says meat. It don't say you got to sleep, eat, drink, nothing. Just meat. So, somebody saying keep your word. You got a, a contract to meet in this lifetime. All right? Oh, my God. I feel like... <laughs> How you want to act? <laughs> How do you want to act? How you want to act in this situation? Oh, my God. All right. So if you have a, a contract to meet with somebody in this lifetime, they want to know how somebody's initials may be first uh, D, first, middle, and last. The person could potentially be a Libra. The person may live down south, Arkansas, Georgia, Mississippi. Wow. Okay. So this person is not dating. Okay. Okay. They waiting on you. They want to know how you want to act. The person is saying, I adore you. And they want to make positive changes in your life. I appreciate you so much. And they want to turn the tables, basically go on vacation with you to maybe Croatia or something. Um, damn. Like, what is happening here? Magic is everywhere. Okay, so I'm a, the person is just, okay, saying what they saying. Damn. I wasn't expecting that. <clears throat> Oh, I hear y'all want more. Okay, let's see what we got. Okay, so whatever you asked, they said, yeah. They doing daily rituals trying to get you close to them. The person could be a, a caregiver or a healer, a CNA or medical assistant, or you could be, or they could be connected to. And we have somebody giving rich bitch vibes. We got East Coast, West Coast, significant or important, different time zones. The person could potentially be a producer, I also hear boss bitch vibes, a director, a spa owner, um, someone that works in a spa setting, an esthetician, um, somebody could live in Maine or they want you to be their Maine or something about Kansas. The person likes shots of white liquor. Um, they want you to drink more water here. They also say in positive vibes only. Make sure you take care of yourself. Um, something about Friday, you're important to them. Person could potentially be a rapper, a hit maker, MC. They're saying they're better off because of you. Perhaps we can arrive to a compromise. It's going to be difficult for you to forgive them, but they love you. Um, the person could potentially be a Capricorn. They could potentially, uh, there's more vacation vibes here, Little Italy. The person could potentially be a life coach. They have tattoos. Um, they're saying, teach them how to love. They wasn't taught them how to love. They wasn't taught how to love, but they want you to teach them how to love. This person may own a boat or y'all may be going out on a boat. This person, um, has spiritual gifts or they know you have spiritual gifts. Um, and they want to accept you for everything you are. We got more vacation, Austria vibes here. We got stargazing. That could be night stars or star watching stars. Again, person saying they're not dating, they're promising because maybe you might think they're lying. Um, they're saying they make thoughtful decisions to support their highest good. This is your divine counterpart talking and something about Thursday and the person could potentially be a cancer. Okay, so yeah, there's all of that person needed to get that off their chest. All right, so I guess I wasn't expecting that, though. I can surely tell you that much. That was serious. Okay. All right. So let's see what else we got here. Messages for Pisces, please. Please and thank you. Okay. That is your official person. They're going to make you a privileged lady. There will be sudden wealth coming in your on your on your pathway. Your pathway is actually clear. You and this person community may or may not may or may not move into a community. But oh, wow. Okay, this person thinks about you a lot. Always in their thoughts, always in the head. Mature man, so this person may be older than you. But either way, you're free to do whatever it is that you wish to do. We have uh, apparently community support here. Um, so I'm guessing that may be pertaining to the person's family. There's unexpected income. We got community also here. A house right there. Like I'm literally telling y'all, wealthy man, the stuff was lining up the way it was just lining up pathway. So I know y'all probably was like, you know, where'd she get that from? I was actually literally looking at it. So um, yeah, there's that. sudden wealth in a this reading is turning out to be freaking amazing okay i like it apparently they said there's a change in the wind thank god 
Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate you. All right, let's get you a past life card out here. Let's see what we over here talking about. All right, flew right out too. All right, so let's see what we got here. Extraterrestrial. Okay. So a close encounter, a off work, off worlder. We have watcher or guardian, an early death dweller. Okay, so we have identity. You were a sibling. Time frame was classical antiquity. Lesson was leadership. You died from a fire. The location was Northern Europe. Trauma, physical limitation. Your faith was agonistic and atheist. Um, your love, domestic abuse. Okay, wow. All right, well, that's what you got for that. And let's see. Hmm. People out here doing the most, huh? Doing stuff they damn sure ain't got no business doing. All right, let's see. Messages for Pisces. Y'all do not mind me because it's just stuff happening right here. All right, so something is not the right time for you to do. You see that? Um, whatever you were thinking, they want you to get more information and this is a sign. So something is not the right time because you need to get more information and this is a sign, okay? So there's that. Okay, so we have the goat. Okay, the number's 13. Fearless I am in the path I choose. Oh, hold on. Fearless I am in the path that I choose, for I've never been led astray, always finding my way. All right, so there's that. And then we got B. So B's have been coming up in the readings lately. So um, B1, don't drink all of the life from one flower, for there are many to taste and many to explore. So we have that. I feel like I want this card right here. So let's see. All right, they're saying be honest. Be honest. Heart to heart conversations are necessary. It is safe for you to talk about your feelings. Yes. All right. Okay, divine timing. Be patient while things are unfolding. This connection is worth the wait. All right, so you got that. All right, Pisces, I love you. This is the reading. Hopefully it helps. Thank you guys for coming towards my channel. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and go with God. Save.